Hi, good evening. Got Cronus on the Amstrad CPC. So it's the first game that I'm going to be playing on the, on the Amstrad. A bit of a long story, cut it short. It took ages to get some leads for, for the tape deck for it. So, but managed to get them. Good mate of mine, Steve, made them up for me. So, thanks, Steve. So, Cronus on the on the Amstrad, released in 1987 by Mastertronics, and fond memories of this game on the Select Spectrum. So smooth, music at the beginning was absolutely mind blowing for the um, 48K, and it, a lot of people thought it was the AY chip, but it wasn't because it worked on the um, on the 48K through the bleeper, through the actual um, Spectrum. And unfortunately, this version hasn't got that music, and a bit disappointed because I was hoping that it would have to set some music in the beginning, but obviously it hasn't, so they cut it out. So it's crossed between six levels, and every level gets harder. So it's a horizontal shoot 'em up game. So joystick on for the start of the game. <clears throat> so you control your ship, and already, I mean. It's not a bad port, I wouldn't say, because the game gameplay is still there. The sound effects are possibly better than the Spectrum, <clears throat> but the game just feels sluggish. It does. It feels like the ship's actually floating, and it takes a while to get anywhere on the screen. But yeah, Coronas on the Sega Spectrum for me was. It was just a brilliant shoot em up game, you could just put it in and play. Unfortunately I'm going to be tapping the fire button because you can't use auto fire because it doesn't fire. It doesn't, so you've got to keep tapping the, the fire button all the time. But, <clears throat> see, I mean that was annoying that was because I, I had that shit. And you feel like I can't shoot the enemies because you're going too sort of slow and you tend to avoid them rather than shoot them. I'm glad that they kept the um, the flames out the back of the um, of the ship, <coughs> which everything's sort of there. But I'm, I can't remember if the Spectrum version changes its colour in on the next level, so it just swaps. Could be wrong, but I'm not sure if this version does. But it feels like the firing as well. You fire out a little amount of bullets, and then you sort of you sort of don't. It's like there, I could have died in both <coughs> things. And you get these power ups as well that you collect. I think beef for bonus points, and you get extra lives on the way through for different scores. <coughs> I was really close to completing the Spectrum version there, it's got to level 6. But this version seems harder due to the, um, the sluggish of it. You tend to avoid the enemies rather than um, kill them. But the gameplay is still there, I feel. I haven't seen any, any review, well, save game reviews <coughs> like the magazines that I found online I think one website gave it a 6 and said that the game was pretty boring average, average sound effects and everything but nevertheless it, 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 I just remember this game just being really really great but unfortunately I'm not really enjoying, I mean I'll pay if I have the game, I will enjoy it, but coming from the, um, from the Spectrum, you just need concentration, I remember, um, <coughs> I think it was level 3 or level 4, that I had hello mum, and I remember calling my mum just to say look, <coughs> computer's like saying hello. Right, Chronos level end, so this is going to be the end of level 1. It did change, but it wasn't as good as what I thought. And it picks up the extra life, so these things are going to be annoying. Every stage, there's different like enemies you have to kill, so obviously there's these like, square things you have to shoot. 
you see we've got this, um, the same ships that come at you. But they're going to be a nuisance they are because <coughs> I can't believe I've died there. Well, I've, uh, I thought I would have died then. <coughs> but yeah, I, I played the Spectrum version recently and it does, as I said, it does feel sluggish this one. I don't know if it was released for the 64. But it'd be nice to see if, if it was. <clears throat> it gives me something to do, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I wasn't sure this came out on the Amstrad. I was down at, um, what do you call it, down Manchester. And I saw this and I just picked it up straight away. So that's the play Manchester in October this year. I just end up buying loads and loads of Spectrum games and anything that I could find that I want to play. <clears throat> Two lights are there because I've died in there with that thing. <clears throat> it feels funny not having the, um, the loading music at the beginning of the game. I guess you can turn like your tape deck up, but still on two lives, I thought I was going to fly up. I'm giving this go a bit better, I guess. <coughs> but I really want to complete this on the spectrum, I do. So I never finished it when I was younger. Level 6, but I just end up dying all the time. Still two lives. Right, what's that? Enduro fuel or something. Oh, I missed that one. There's no way you can. No, there's no way you can shoot them because <clears throat> if you end up going down, you've got no like bombs or anything you can fire down. That's going to fire up, isn't it? Okay. Destroy <clears throat> the alien. It's a lot easier with this game on with your joystick on the desk that is and hold it in your hands. Alright, let's get these. Let's get that one. I'll afford that. <coughs> but it's not slowing down which is great. I, I guess that there isn't really much to slow the system down. I knew I wouldn't escape that one. It was it was moving up and down. Trying to never end, so come up to level three. God, that. I don't know what the use was for. <coughs> Walk gate, so here we go, we're gonna go to the next level. There's a bit better colours that is, makes the game a bit more <coughs> brighter, really. And it's good that the back, the um, the scores and everything down the bottom changed as well. I'm not sure if I noticed that on the thingy. Uh, a tiny little bit of parallax with the stars in the background. This could be game over soon. This could be I can feel it. It's a shame that auto fire doesn't work because my fingers are starting to ache now. I don't know what's new on this level, I don't know if these were. <clears throat> oh, these tubes, they're new. which is good. <clears throat> I dodged that one. It's just when they, um, th these things, when they like move, you've got to 
but you've got to follow their patterns where they're going. There we go, hello mum. <laughs> I don't know if this, I think the spectrum was like M U M U M instead of M O M, like the Americans like way. Maybe margar margarita. <coughs> I don't remember that one. But yeah, as I said, I'm, I'm, I think the game's really great. I do. The, the, the Amstrad isn't the better port. <coughs> but it's def it is definitely playable. It's a little shoot, shoot em up game. Crash. Give me a couple of seconds <coughs> to rest my fingers on the fire button. One life. <coughs> but this level feels a lot easier than the first level. It's just. I guess as soon as you get the enemies straight at you. You don't let them too far on the screen. Then really shouldn't have a problem. And level six was a purple stage. I'm a bit confused why I grabbed that and see if that can out haven't given us any extra life at all. Right, it's another <coughs> warp zone. That's not as bad because <coughs> it's a bit glary on the camera though. But, alright, go up there. I'm going to call these out. Something welcome to something city, I didn't get that. Oh no, right at the last minute, but I've got an extra life though, <coughs> which was good. I used to call these fudges. <coughs> so they look like, um, like fudge. Oh, Try to avoid it, but I couldn't. Is that it? Game over. All right, my fingers are aching, but I'm going to leave it there. But I, I, ha I did enjoy that. I did. I, even though I do rate the, um, the Spectrum version of it, I do. But I didn't come top. Oh, well. But that's Coronas on the uh, on the Antrad CPC. Thanks for watching. Good night.